Hi, my name's Thad with Mold Medics. Um, what we're going over today is DIY air purifier called a Corsi Rosenthal box. And it's very simple. You just need a 20 inch box fan, a couple 20 by 20 by one inch furnace filters, should be MERV 13 rated or higher, some cardboard, duct tape and a marker and you can get it taken care of. This was invented during the COVID-19 pandemic as a way to improve indoor air quality to remove viral particles but does a great job with mold, any other small particulate, dust, um, soot from burning of candles or fireplaces. So it's filtering out things uh, with a really, really small micron level. And it's just a way to instantly increase your indoor air quality. So you see these arrows? That's the way we want the air go flowing through this side. So like when you install a furnace filter, it tells you you want from the return side, it comes down and it should always be installed this way. Basically, we're just gonna make a square. So we just gotta create 20 inch strips of tape for the corners. And we'll create our box. Super basic, just make the cube to start. What do you use it for in your house? I build it and I have it currently in my basement but the first weekend I built it, I actually made a fire in my wood-burning fireplace downstairs and I got a bunch of smoke in my basement. So I ended up kicking it on and it cleared out the room pretty quick. I'm using it just currently in my basement during winter when I'm doing a lot of burning because that puts a, little part, a lot of particulate in the air. This is just a way to reduce the soot and all the dust from the wood. So there's your basic cube. So now we got to build the base. So again, you can just use that same piece of cardboard that the fan came in. It's going to be a good size. What I would do would just be put it right here and then just outline it. On the outside of the box? Yeah, on the outside of the box. And you can see, again, all of the arrows are pointing for the air to go in. We want all the air being drawn in through these four sides. We're doing this real quick. I mean, you can take your time on this and make it perfect, but it's more about function than how it really looks. You just want to make sure that all the seals, any open areas are sealed. So like right here's a little gap. We want the air being pulled through here. We don't want the air being pulled around the filtration. So sealing all of the edges, so again, when the fan is turned on, it's pulling the air through each filter. Now, basically what we're gonna do is we just have to mount this on top of here. What we'll do is we're going to have a little cardboard border here and really the opening is gonna be right here so it's not pulling. It's a more focused suction like towards the middle where it's drawing rather than drawing from all over. So that helps just create a stronger pressurization. I mean, you can spend hundreds, even thousands of dollars on air purifiers. I walk into a lot of our customers' houses and they have multiple thousand dollar air purifiers. And while they're going to be better than this, but this is something you can throw in an old dirty basement, your woodworking shop, replace, or every six months replace the filters really anywhere to improve air quality. So again, we just want to cover all these holes. Like this is a tricky thing with this. This fan's a little round, so it's not perfectly square. So like I ended up covering mine completely with tape. So just totally seal the top up and then we'll have to seal the side and then we'll be close to being done here. So here is your Corsi Rosenthal box. And this is the moment of truth. See that sticking? So if it's holding up a piece of toilet paper, it's definitely pulling dust through there. So thanks for watching our uh, tutorial on the Corsi Rosenthal box. Stay tuned, we'll have more tutorials on how to improve your indoor air quality soon.